Ladies and gentlemen, may I ask everyone to stand as we all welcome our dashy loving debutants, Alea, Lavelle, Laura.
I met you as the girl singing the solo with me on our fifth grade graduation stage at Hughes Elementary. From then on, I've had the privilege of, to see, of seeing all the sides of you, your beautiful smiles, your infectious laughs, and your lovely expressions, uh, expressive faces. You spread joy everywhere you go, and your presence puts a smile on my face every time. As you turn 18, I'm so excited for all the incredible things that lie ahead of you for lie ahead for ahead for you in life. I got you two gifts. First is a Taylor Swift keychain because you're not a Leia without Taylor Swift. My second gift to you is a Himalayan salt lamp. Not to sound like a thesis statement, but the lamp symbolizes how you light up everybody's day. I remember us meeting our sophomore year, and I didn't know you that well, but over the years we've gotten a lot closer. But ever since I met you, I've always felt very comfortable around you. Um, for your gift, I got you a One Direction record, especially Midnight Memories, because I remember in ninth grade, um, since I was online, and the first time I came like into school, it was in Miss Brunson's room, and she played Midnight Memories, and you and I were like the only one like jamming out, and I'm like, this girl is amazing, like I love her. And so I got you a record, and I just want you to know that you are so beautiful inside and out, and I genuinely admire you, and happy birthday. <laughs> I still remember the first time we met Hostess State, we yapped the entire car ride. And it was like three hours, so we really did yap. And then we got there and wreaked havoc. We broke the iron table, trying to iron everything. We knocked like everything over. But my best memory from that trip was that I was complaining how I could not curl my hair. I was like, I can't curl my hair. And she went, let me. She was like, it's literally my thing. She said, let me. And she took 30 minutes, she curled my hair. And by the time we were done, we had to go. And I was like, oh my God, you didn't get ready. She goes, I know, but you look cute. Aww. So she got ready. So she threw some, she put her hair in like braids as we were walking downstairs. And I was like, I have never met someone so caring and loving about other people. And I don't think I ever will. You are so caring and attentive to other people and you put everyone before you. So for me, Alea means love. I brought you stocks yeah, so that you can earn a lot of money. <laughs> Um, but with that money, I hope that you can use it for uh, what I want you to do is like traveling. More so traveling in a way to bring you adventures in life uh, wherever it will take you. Because uh, I know you're 18 right now, but girl, you're only 18. There's so much to live for. And also so much more to not live for. However, you will experience a lot in life. And um, it'll be hard. I'm only 19, but like it's, it'll be hard. Um, <laughs> I, but like, I can tell from one year who's older than you by one year, it gets more difficult. Uh, but hopefully with the money and stocks that life would be easier for you. Um, because money is not happiness, but it could buy you something to make you happy. Hi, Alea. Happy birthday. I want to start off the speech. Oh, thank you. I just wanted to start off the speech with a story. So I was at the store with my mom and my mom's like, okay, what are you going to get for Alea? I was like, oh, I don't know. And she's like, she says her iconic phrase. My mom is Filipino, by the way. <laughs> so my mom says her iconic phrase. She's like, I am what's Saimo. So she like walks away. <laughs> she like walks away and I'm just like looking at my mom. And I'm like, okay. And then it dawned on me. And then Alea, I just wanted you to know you are at this point of your life. You are turning 18. You're a whole adult. You're entering a new era of your life and I've just watched you grow and blossom into such a beautiful lady and going into adulthood you're gonna achieve so many things. Hi Alea, I just want to say you look so beautiful today and I just want to talk about how I'm super grateful for Alea being one of my friends especially because when I first moved here to Texas I didn't really know much people except I knew Alea from family friends and I just wanted to thank her and I always am thankful for her being there being one of my first friends when I first moved here because you really helped me grow and help a lot with my future being here in Texas and I also want to help you in your future and hope you grow and I hope for the best for you so I got you a little like money a little bank thing where you can put little like money coins you can put any slips of paper anything you're free to put it as yours now but not only does uh, your box come with anything you can put into it but it's a gives it more than a box plus like a representation of your personal growth and memories and whatever you have in the future and happy birthday um first of all happy birthday alea um it's been a very long adventure with her i still remember when we were in jersey and um i went to one of her birthday parties and i was the one trying to blow with the candle um 
And I remember how we went on a uh, tr family trip to the water park and I almost drowned. Um, and she saved me. Um, but besides that, it's really great seeing you grow up and especially um, reaching this milestone of 18 years old, which is beyond me. Um, it's really great to see and for my gift I got. Um, it was more symbolic. I don't think you can really use it, but <laughs> it's a jar of keys. And um, now that you're entering a new stage of your life, adulthood, obviously, um, I want you to see those keys and remember that there's going to be new opportunities presented towards you. And those opportunities will obviously be behind closed doors. And I want you to remember that as you see those closed doors and as you see challenges ahead of you, there's always going to be a way to unlock those closed doors. I remember sophomore year when we, you, were thinking, you reached out to me about starting a Filipino club in our high school. We started it with not a lot of members, but we were able to finish that year and grow. And going into my junior year and her senior year, we started it again. But recently, a lot of our meetings have not went to plan. But thankfully, Alea is such a great leader. She shows her leadership in our meetings, in just emailing our sponsor, just being a good communicator and a leader. Uh, I'm grateful to have her as a partner, as a leader, because without her, I don't know what I'm gonna do next year. Hi, Lavelle. Um, my treasure for you is a book. It's called uh, 18, which, uh, 18 Years, sorry. <laughs> and it's just an important reminder to cherish um, every year of your life and to not just learn from your mistakes but also to strive towards your goals. Um, I admire how you appreciate the simple and little things in life and how you always stay true to yourself no matter what. Uh, just like the pages within, each chapter holds the essence of your journey, symbolizing the growth, resilience, and the endless possibilities that await in the next chapters of your life. You always know how to make anyone smile, and I hope everyone appreciates appreciates you the way I do. And for the gifts today, I got you a Taylor Swift shirt, so you can express yourself to your wor to the world and show off your ability to make people laugh and smile. And I also got you a Bath and Body Works set, and also a candle. So as you go on to conquer the world, I hope it lightens up a path to your future filled with prosperity and relaxation. Um, so what we gave you was a jump starter for your car. <laughs> um, I know once I went to college, I like to travel around and I'm thinking that you will too. Um, it represents that in any situation that there's always a way to keep you going. If people around you or situations like um, ending high school or like beginning college trains you, there is always something to make you spark and keep going. The gift that I got for you was a necklace and it has your birthstone on it, which is amethyst. And amethyst symbolizes um, um, peacefulness and calmness, which are traits that you have. Um, so um, happy birthday again, and I wish you all the best in adulthood. On this day, when adulthood shall begin, spotlight shall not sway as you celebrate with kin. Amongst these treasures I bestow, the first to emphasize your beauty through high and low, that I shall carry your finest treasures as you travel None shall measure the challenges you, may, you must tackle. Like this diamond necklace that symbolizes your God-given gifts, talents, beauty, and elegance, I wish you the brightest future ahead of you. My gift for you is an earring with a heart charm. I know heart, the heart symbol is one of the most well-known images, not the heart hospital. But it's one of the most well-known. Um, it became a way to express love. It also represents beauty, wisdom, and most valuable moments in life. Uh, so don't let the business of being an adult to forget about self-love, okay? It's very important to save time, to be healthy and stay pretty, and just dull yourself up, right? Um, sorry, my phone is dying. But so take pleasure in using makeup to look stunning. Uh, beauty kit it also implies that you reach when you reach your womanhood, you must always shine and be neat by taking care of yourself. This beauty kit can help you gain more confidence and show your self-love. Happy birthday. 
this light symbolizes us as your parent um, we're gonna be always be here for you to light and guide you along the way and um, I know sometimes you're frustrated to us but you're our pride and joy and we love you so much and my wish for you is that um, always remember all the all the you know the talks that we have and you can always tell me even though it's not um, I, you know that I don't want you to lie and you can tell me anything I'm not gonna get angry as long as you tell me okay and we'll always be here for you and we love you so much okay whatever you become you know no pressure <laughs> You're 18 now, you're finally an adult. Congrats. You're getting old, older and older by the second. <laughs> um, I would like to thank you for playing such a big part in my life. I met you since the day I was born and you've been throughout me. What? You've been with me through my entire life. You helped me in so many ways. You took care of me when I was sick, protected me, and helped me with so much homework I couldn't even tra keep track. Cause like one time I was doing math homework, we stayed up until one because I couldn't understand anything. I'm so sorry. Um, I would like to say thank you and wish you the best and to be the keep, keep being the sister you are. Happy birthday. Everyone in this room is so lucky to have Inalaya in their life. And happy 18th to my soulmate. I'm glad this invisible string led us to each other. <laughs> I've seen you in all of your ups and downs, and I can say that I'm truly proud of you. Turning 18 means you can finally make all the mistakes that your parents warned you about. Anyways, may your 18 be filled with joy, success, and unforgettable experiences. Hi, Alea. Um, I'm so, so grateful to have known you for the past couple of years. And you're honestly like the genuinely like the sweetest person I know. Like I was trying to write a sweet a speech and I was like, huh, like Alea, like there's just so much to talk about because you're so sweet. You're so kind-hearted. And honestly, like after the hellhole that was AP Chem, when I was able to see you, I was like, wow, like Alea genuinely makes my day better. Do you remember in kindergarten how you'd meet a kid and know nothing about them? Then 10 seconds later, you're playing like your best friends. That's exactly how Alea and I met, and that's exactly how we are now. Alea and, I met, and Alea and my friendship started back in sixth grade when we were 11 years old and couldn't stop laughing about cookies and Tic Tacs. <laughs> Every morning, I would see Alea run into the bus to brush her hair, her crazy hair, actually, and it would take three people to braid it. And now we can take a moment to see how gorgeous her hair looks, but even how gorgeous her heart is. Over the years, I've had the privilege to see Alea grow into a beautiful and elegant young lady. And now here we are celebrating this huge milestone of your 18th birthday. Alea, I'm so proud of the woman that you have become, from a shy girl who would sit in PE and read her book in the corner, to now a girl who literally runs the school as an EKG tag, and so, so much more. I am so proud to call you're one of my best friends. Even when we go weeks without talking to each other, it doesn't feel like we've spent a moment apart. Hi, Alea. You look so beautiful. So, Alea and I met in eighth grade, and it's been a long journey, but I'm so glad I met Alea. You're the most caring, sweetest person ever, and you inspire me every day, and continue to be the most amazing woman ever. I love you so much. Happy 18th birthday. Um, thank you for being a role model and an ate for Sushi and Mia. Um, I'm wishing you an endless adventure, laughter, and success in your life, always and forever. I'm, um, Tita will always be here for you. And happy birthday to a remarkable lady who add joy, who add joy and sunshine to every moment. And I wish oh my goodness, I wish you all the best. And um, I don't know, I'm speechless. 
speechless. <laughs> I wish you good luck on your your dreams. And You're a pride and joy to your mom and dad. And thank you very much for guiding him. You're a role model. Uh, may this light guide you to some part of darkness in adulthood. <laughs> and may you continue to shine your light as you grow and continue to be a blessing to everyone. The light of that candle symbolizes the light of Christ. May His light always shines in your heart so that you can be a light to others. And may you always keep that light in your heart. And Christ, of course, keep in your life and he, you'll never be alone. That's His promise. Happy birthday. The 18th birthday, Alea. May all your wishes and dreams come true and always find uh, to pursue uh, that dream. Uh, wish you good luck uh, in your journey, and I wanna see you as a young, successful pediatrician in the next 10 years. <laughs> Happy birthday. Happy birthday. As you celebrate this milestone in your life, May the light of that candle remind you that there are a lot of people, especially your wonderful parents, that will always support you and guide you to achieve your goals. So, surround yourself with godly people who will inspire you to, do be, to be the best version of yourself. Happy birthday. Your mom and dad's proudest moments you know you're all grown strong and beautiful we just wish you all the best and happiness on your 18th birthday though I we don't see each other all the time I feel like you know I've known you all your life with you your mom and myself chatting all the time you know comparing notes raising kids um, but yeah good luck and just remember to always put God in the center of your life because with that you can never go wrong. turning 18 is a special um, Thing, especially for us Filipinos. Um, we celebrate it because you're now an adult uh, and with adulthood you'll have more responsibilities and of course more freedom but of course uh, all we wish for you is to be guided by those uh, the lessons you've learned to the past 18 years and we wish all the happiness and success in whatever um, um, thing that you want to do. I know you're going to med school and congratulations. So I'm going to start with a um, Bible verse. Um, Let your light shine before men so that people may see your good deeds and glorify the Father who is in heaven. Um, with the lighting of this candle, I hope that your path ahead is illuminated with love, joy, and success. As you step into this new phase of life, may every step you take lead you to unique adventures and new avenues of opportunities. Embrace this journey and keep chasing your dreams. And here's to a bright and exciting future. Happy birthday. I met Love Love the day she was born. I was there inside the room, right? <laughs> um, she used to be so shy. Um, when she meet people, she would hide under the, the table and it takes her about an hour to come out. Um, but um, seeing you right now, I have nothing but pride um, in how you're turn, turning out to be this young adult. You are so beautiful, not only from outside, but mostly from the inside. Um, you're so kind-hearted. You're, you're a good daughter. You're a good sister. Um, and we are so proud of you. So there are three things that I wish you not to do. So first off is don't forget where you came from because that um, will guide you to your future destinations. Um, and of course, um, I, I wanted you to not forget about who you are because that will actually remind you and that would not confuse you when people start that judging. But also I wanted you to not forget the people that loves you 
many of them is inside this room and I wanted you to remember that and no matter what happens we'll always be here for you we love you and we're so proud of you happy birthday I, th I don't know what to say I, I can say all of the above <laughs> but anyway knowing you love love I mean, it's a blessing to be part of, you know, your 18 years. It might mean, it might not be the first year of your life, but at least, you know, halfway, I was there for you. Um, I know you. I know your mom. You know, always. You know, I don't know. I feel like I raised you as well. <laughs> you, you know, you don't know it, but it's just like your mom is always asking some advice. You know, since I have your Ate Camille. So, but anyway, um, the only thing I would like to say is always be grateful. You know, gratitude and enhance your life. Embrace and appreciate every moment, whether good or bad, or in between. Life may be difficult, as what everyone says, but always look for the good side. It doesn't matter, you know, how hard it is. In a band paper, it's white, but there's always spot in there of black. Don't look on that black thing. Look around you. There's always a bad, you know. There's always a good stuff around you. If you feel frustrated in life, it's okay. It's okay not to be okay. Remember that. And mistakes are, are like stepping stones. Be grateful for each one, and they will be your journey in life. Failures and disappointments offer opportunities for self-improvement, express gratitude all the time. Because when you're grateful, when you're thankful, blessings will come, bount you know, bountiful blessings will be coming your way. So I know you will be, you are so blessed with your parents always, you know, beside you and support you. And don't forget, you know, and I know you're very sweet, and I can see that throughout, you know, like all, all this thing that we're planning to, your dad, your mom, your very good daughter. And thank you for picking me as your meaning as well. Everybody, if you don't already know me, my name is Alea. <laughs> um, I just wanted to thank everyone for coming and spending this night with me. I wanted to say that I'm so thankful. <laughs> Sorry. Sorry, I'm really emotional. <laughs> I want to say thank you for everyone who took the time to celebrate with me. <laughs> <laughs> I was doing so well until now. Um, and I want to say thankful because, or say thank you to feeling all of y'all's love tonight. I want to say a special thanks to my parents and my family. <laughs> because without them, I would not be here and who I am today. They have shaped me in the best way. And uh, I know that sometimes I might not listen or <laughs> I'm, a, I'm a teenage girl and, you know, sometimes I just don't want to listen to what they know is right. And I'm so grateful that they take the time and the patience to learn with me and teach me. I want to say thank, thank you to everybody who helped this entire day um, happen. I want to say thank you to my friends, especially for all <laughs> being a part of this big day. I want to say a special thank you, especially to the Dela Cruz family, because <laughs> they have been here throughout it all, from the beginning to the end and everything. All the sleepless nights, all the long hours of this work um, that took or in two months, which is kind of crazy if you really think about how big this is. 
And I want to say thank you to everybody who participated, especially like, you know, all my 18 roses, 18 candles, 18 treasures. I just want to say thank you that um, you guys love me this much that you guys would be a part of this special day with me. Thank you.